this video, we take a look at every code for 2023, as well with every secret item hidden throughout the map and every way you can get free items and build a boat that you may not know about. So be sure to stay tuned throughout the entire video and also like and subscribe. Let's not waste any more time. Let's hop straight into it. Now, of course, we have to start it off with the RB Battle Secret because you're still able to do this to this day. You're still able to go do the mini game inside the secret room and get the free bits and and also gold reward all you have to do is put the key in and go to the secrets and complete but i don't want to go into too much detail on that because we've all probably seen it a million times you complete the computer boss and that's about it but moving on if you shoot this wall inside of this castle stage right here it opens up this secret area where you're actually able to claim some free pvp items on top of that you also get some free gold but basically what you have to do is survive all the stages here and you get three free items this will take a little bit of time but it's way easier with friends and you can see you get these three items right here on top of that if you actually make your way over to the crystal stage which uh, usually spawns in the middle of the stages bring some cannons with you and if you just want to shoot all the crystals on the wall and it'll teleport you inside of the secret area once again if you have friends helping you out with this it is going to be a little bit faster but it doesn't take too long and this is actually how you get free portals inside of build a boat you're gonna get teleported inside of the secret area just like this and you basically just want to walk through this area now you're gonna have to find all three crystals hidden throughout the uh, crystal maze uh, and you're gonna bring them back over there to the middle these are kind of hidden and uh, they all spawn in the same spot every time so if you've done this before it should be pretty easy to help out a friend but once you have all the crystals here you guys will see that it spawns in this chest right here straight from the sky and you get the portal and on top of that you also get some free gold as well so uh you know it's not bad whatsoever and i believe you get like four to eight portals from that i think it's four but yeah it's really good so this next one is how you actually get the zeg plushie now a lot of players don't actually know you can do this but if you go to this mini game right here and you try to stop this right in the middle of those two magnets right there then you actually get the plushie but i've already got it so i can't get it again but you guys can see right here you can claim it also moving on here we have the neon blocks go inside the wild west stage and go through this wall and you can see you'll actually get neon blocks from there and these are actually for robux inside the shop so it's really not that bad of a deal moving on to the washing machine stage go here complete this mini game this will give you the free golden harpoons all you have to do is go to the washing machine stage click on the remotes and watch the magic happen you just have to survive all rounds of this boss fight but in the end you get some free gold and also the golden harpoons so it's pretty much worth it i'd say because i use those all the time and those are also for robux inside the shop as well moving on here this is how to actually get free potions inside of the game and make your way inside of the enchanted forest stage and go to this little wall right here it's gonna bring you inside of the secret area where you have to make custom potions click on the, the two white berries and one blueberry it'll make a sleep potion throw it at the eyeball just like this he's gonna open it up and boom there's a chest with free potions and gold this right here is how to get the chill thrill 709 plushie but uh we all pretty much know how to do that there's also another secret way to make some free items in gold go inside a project zeg and go through this portal right here this is actually the zeg boss fight where you can claim some free items take a left and boom you're here inside of it i made it you can claim some free zeg plushies and also some free gold from completing this so in total you will have four zeg plushies added to your account after you complete that boss fight the game is called project zeg for those of you guys wondering but when you actually type it into the experiences nothing shows up up. so uh i recommend just like deleting the last letter and you guys can see it right there and this is actually where you play so i uh, just join this game and uh complete the boss fight for the free build a boat reward the cake blocks are also one of the most popular items inside of the game that are super reliable and a block that i use pretty much every single time i play build a boat for treasure there's just so many uses for it a lot of you guys comment how to actually get cakes and there's pretty much only one way to get cakes they did have them inside of a few codes inside of the past but since those codes have expired which there's literally only one way now and that is to join build a boat for treasure on your roblox account birthday or near your roblox account birthday if you're wondering how to see when your roblox account was created it's actually very very easy all you have to do is go over to your profile and it'll say right here if you scroll down your statistics is your join date right there so you can see when your roblox account was created but there's still some more free items that i want to show you guys and then we'll get into the codes of 2023 so let's hop straight into yet again another item location all you have to do is go inside of this stage right here with a cannon i do recommend you have a cannon or a hand cannon with you because uh in case one doesn't work out you have the other but all you have to do is shoot this room right here like that oh and you guys can see i just missed right there of course that's why you have the hand cannon that's exactly why i said to bring one i just want to shoot this wall right here because this wall actually breaks and then it'll lead you inside of this little room right here and inside of here you can actually claim some free thrusters which is actually pretty cool this is what it looks 
like when you actually claim it on a new account for those of you guys that are wondering you can see right here we go up to the chest and what bam 175 gold and also two of the thruster so there's a lot of free items to actually get claimed inside a build a boat for treasure and i don't even think i included all of them i think i forgot about the worthy one plushie but for those of you guys that don't know about that there's actually one inside of this stage right here if you actually shoot the uh the door on this cabin on the left if you shoot that uh, door right there the worthy one plushie is sitting right inside of it just like so but i think we've covered pretty much all of the free items inside of the game with all of the locations with them yeah i think we covered just about everything so i think it's now time to get into the codes for 2023 it's time to get on a brand new account and start redeeming these things let's get started all right as you guys can see i'm on a completely brand new account here and i even have the little tutorial um should we go through the tutorial nah i don't think so we're gonna close out of that but as you guys can see i literally have no blocks it's time to start it off go over to our codes here and we're gonna start off with of course the codes that literally give five gold each so we're gonna do hi just like that we're also going to do equal sign and then p just like that as well and then we're also going to do equal sign and then b as well these are all the codes uh, inside of build a boat for treasure but we still have two more we still have two more codes to go over. Let's go back to our menu. Let's type in Bill Thrill 709 was here. If we type that in, that's going to give us the free firework. But stay tuned because I'm going to show you guys why that firework is so overpowered. But then if we go back here and we type in the last one, which is going to be Squid Army like this, we get 22 gold and also 22 snow blocks. So it's not bad right there. Now you're probably wondering what's so good about the firework block. I'm going to show you here in just a second. All we're going to need though is literally three gold literally that's all we're going to need so let's get inside of our chair here and let's go this way literally all we need is three gold guys i'm gonna show you why the firework is so overpowered all right so we're gonna go inside of here just like this and we're just going to oof there we go all right now we're gonna claim our free gold there we go we're gonna go inside of our shop and we're going to buy a hinge block just like this so now that we have the hinge block we can now make a thousand gold in our first run and you're probably wondering how in the world am i gonna do that I'm going to load up the thin ice quest. I'm going to turn anchor block off, place a seat, sit here, place a firework, and then the hinge block that we just got. I'm going to delete the chair, and I'm just going to start going. I think I'm also going to press launch as well, and now we're off. Now, simply, all I have to do is make it to the end, and I'm going to complete the hardest quest in literally a one minute. And this is going to give me 1,000 gold. This is why the firework is so overpowered. Just watch what happens. All right, so far, so good. We're making it through the stages. We're almost there. We have to watch out for this stage, though. This could get ugly. We do not want to get hit by one of those lightnings. All right, and we now made it to the last stage before we get to the chest. Now, all I have to do once I'm up here is just simply click on the firework, drop down, and boom. A thousand gold, a hundred blocks, and on top of that, I get to open the chest and claim another free gold block and also some free gold. It's literally that easy, and that's why the firework is so overpowered. And on top of that, I get some free chest as well. Don't mind if I do. We're already off to a very good start on our brand new you build a boat for treasure account now also with that firework you can pretty much complete all the other quests but i'm not going to show that in this video but with that fly glitch you can complete the find me quest the ramp quest the target quest and the cloud quest super easily you might need a harpoon for the soccer one but other than that you guys get the idea be sure to drop a big thumbs up and make sure you guys subscribe and i'll see you all inside of the next one peace out and goodbye